today we're back in the kitchen. Something completely different today. This fish that you see in front of you here today is what we call gurnet. And this is a bycatch to the hake that the people catch off here on the southern coast. You can see when you feel the skin, there's like no uh, scales on it whatsoever. It's a very leathery skin. And in the old days, the only people that ever got to eat this were the local people and the people that actually caught the hake on the boats because it was really a bycatch of the hake. But as time went by and people realized that this is a really nice tasty, tasty fish and I tell you today this is probably one of my favorite favorite dishes to make. It is so simple, it is so easy. I'm going to show you guys how to do it today. The first thing you have to do is to go ahead and to take that skin off. And because it's such a leathery skin, it's actually quite easy to do it. You just get the knife underneath there and you just slide it along like that, like you would do with most any fish you can get. And voila, skin is off, as you can see. And then the next thing you do is you just take out that raw row of bones that you find right in the middle there. And it's really important to take this out because those bones are quite hefty and quite sharp. So you want to get them out and there you go and there is a fillet all nicely cleaned and ready for the pan. I'm going to finish the rest of these up and then I'm going to show you guys how to cook this garnet. Once these fillets are nicely cleaned like that, the thing that you want to make sure with the garnet is that you do not use too many spices. What happens with this fish, it's a really fantastic tasting fish, so you don't need a lot of stuff to go on there. All you want to put on there is just a little bit of seasoning, just a little bit of salt and pepper, and maybe a bit of lemon towards the end of the dish, and I'll show you guys how to do that. We're really going to deglaze the pan with just a little bit of squeeze of lemon, and that is going to go over the fish afterwards to just bring the taste of the fish out as well. Yeah. You wait till the pan is nice and hot, and then you just drop them in. I like to put them in with their skin was, first of all, first down, because that's where it's at its firmest and it holds together really nicely at the bottom. And then I'm gonna just turn them over one time and they're ready to eat. It's actually very, very quick. Okay. I'm going to just put the lid on and turn the heat down just a little bit so they can just cook right through because I don't want to put these in the oven. I just want to do the whole thing on the stove top because it really gives that nice crispy uh, flavor and texture on the outside of the skin. As you can see, it's just been a couple of minutes and the gun is ready to come out of the pan. Now we're really just busy deglazing the pan with a little bit of that uh, lemon juice that we put in there. Just getting all the flavors in there, getting it nicely together. Okay, I just want to strain out the bits and pieces that are in there. So we just have a beautiful clear sauce going over the face. And this is what we want. There you go, garnet with butter and salt and pepper and nothing else. And now it's ready to be tasted by our connoisseur. It smells so nice. There you go. Thank you. Have a taste. Get a little bit of the sauce as well if you can. It's really nice. <laughs> hey? You can never go wrong with a little bit of fresh garnet. Salt, pepper, lemon juice. That's it. <laughs> Put down the camera and come and taste. And then before you, you're drooling on the table. <laughs> mm.